Over the next several minutes, we'll take you through the fascinating details of how Depew chose a business process, selected a partner, deployed an RFID solution, and realized a return on investment in just a few months, all the while increasing accuracy for their surgeon clients. In the old system, the inspection process took anywhere from 10 minutes to 30 minutes per set. In the new process, using RFID technology, we've cut that down to under a minute. I think the RFID system is great. Hi, I'm Dave Johnson. I'm the Director of Distribution for Depew at Johnson & Johnson Company. Depew is a $4.4 billion company worldwide. Our main product is orthopedic implants. The joint replacement business is a highly inventory intensive business. And that's what we'd like to talk about today. How we want to use RFID to control this express care loan or inventory. It's very important that the, the components inside the express care sets are accurate. The surgeons, depending on the exact product to be there when they make the cut, they have instrumentation that says they want to make a, a, a cut for a size 4, and when they make that cut for a size 4, they're expecting to have that size 4 implant in the box. That's why it is imperative that when we send these express care sets out, that we have the exact components that are, that are supposed to be in those kits, in the kits when they ship. I'm Alano Porter. I've been with uh, Johnson Johnson for a little over six years, all with Depew. My main responsibility is to get the daily shipments out every day um, to our customers. Our biggest challenge in Express Curve is definitely the check-in process. We have to manually scan each and every barcode for part and lot number to determine what was actually used out of the set. So it's definitely our biggest bottleneck. The drawbacks of the old process is that it's very labor intensive. Not only is it labor intensive, but it's prone to error. And we cannot have errors. There is no room for error when we ship these express care sets out. Currently, the way we make sure there's 100% accuracy is we do it manually. We, when the product, when we, before we send the kit out, we have to open up every item in the kit, check the kit by barcode scanning each of the items, so we're, we're logging in the lot number, and then we put it back into the kit. It's a very time-consuming process done by humans, and we end up having, there is a, a chance for error in that, in that process. We ship out about 675 kits on average per day. Now, not only do we ship out 675 kits per day, but we also receive 675 kits back per day. So basically, we're, we have to process all of those kits in and out every day. Obviously, we don't have an unlimited supply of kits that we can ship out to the field. So what that means is that we have to use these, we have to turn these kits around quite quickly and put them back out to the field. As, as a matter of fact, 55% of the kits that we receive in today will have to be reprocessed and sent out tonight. The inspection area process takes anywhere from 10 minutes per set to 30 minutes per set. The whip staging area becomes a problem for us in Depew Express Care. And the reason it's a problem for us is because we're in a reactive mode. Sixty-five percent of our customers that call in today expect their orders to be shipped today, which means that at the beginning of the day, we really don't know what we need to work on to ship out that night. So we're in a reactive mode every day. Hi, I'm Patrick Sweeney from Odin Technologies. When Depew, a Johnson & Johnson company, came to Odin looking for RFID expertise, they had two critical issues in mind. Number one was accuracy, and number two was scalability. The complex physics around the devices that were going into each kit was really what the basis of building an accurate platform were based on. They're titanium and cobalt chrome, so we had to make sure that we use physics to our benefit to get 100% read rate. They could also be put into the Express Care kits in any orientation, so tag orientation became critical. The biggest contributing factor to RFID accuracy is rigorous scientific testing. The first question to be answered is always, which frequency is optimal? A consideration for Depew were ISO standards high frequency, 15693, ultra high frequency, 18006, and a proprietary high frequency system. After careful evaluation, the Odin team chose UHF based on ISO standard 18006. The tag price is half the cost of the other alternatives 
and the read range allowed for the biggest kits, containing more than 100 products, to be quickly read with 100% accuracy. This ISO standard also allows for better future interoperability with hospitals and internally for use cases like dock door portals and wearable readers. With dozens of tags to choose from, how do you know what's best? The first step is mapping an RF signature. As you can see, the RF signature map shows exactly where the sweet spot is for placing the tag. The next step is to pick a specific tag based on minimum effective power to get a return signal and orientation sensitivity. As you can see from these easy tag graphs, there are significant performance differences in various types of tags, so scientific testing becomes critical to the overall performance of the system. The optimal tag for Depew was the 4x2 Raflatec Dogbone style. Dave Johnson and his team at Depew were very demanding clients for Odin Technologies. They didn't want to be given readers and tags and software. They wanted a total solution that would meet their business needs. Let's take a minute now to walk through and see what that solution looks like. The new process, we use RFID technology. The RFID technology we're, we're using here in Express Care consists of putting an RFID tag on each one of the implant boxes plus we put an RFID tag on, on the set that the box goes out with. And what we do is when we ship that box out, we put it through an RFID tunnel and it records all of the implants that are in that box. And then when it comes back, it, we put it through a receiving tunnel. And that receiving tunnel will tell us if there's anything missing or changed from one when we sent the product, when we sent the box out originally. Is in the old system, the inspection process took anywhere from 10 minutes to 30 minutes per set. In the new process, using RFID technology, we've cut that down to under a minute. The RFID system is very accurate. We, when we first started the process, uh, we double checked manually along with the RFID system so we can see um, how accurate it was. The accuracy with our RFID process so far has been amazing. Scalability and support are the cornerstone of a good RFID system. Pew wanted a turnkey solution which accounted for environmental constraints and their business process. The Odin Easy Tunnel design is a balance between the business needs of Depew and the physical challenges of the RF environment. The system also had to singulate between items in each kit when multiple kits were on the conveyor at the same time. Inside the tunnel is a specifically tuned antenna array which ensures optimal RF coverage, while the design of specialized shielding material at the entrance and exit provide effective containment of the radio frequency energy. The conveyor was then set to 40 feet per minute and the results? 100% accuracy. We thought it was very important that we chose somebody who had a lot of experience. We knew the, the concept of the physics was important, that we didn't know those answers to the physics. We wanted to make sure that we had somebody who knew that they could achieve a 100% read rate. I, I see RFID as a competitive advantage because now I can take some of my resources and allocate them to other areas. It is very important to plan for support for RFID. One, because it's a very new technology for J&J. &J. J and J does not have the experts to handle this. So we've worked with our partner Odin Technology and they support our system remotely and it's working very nicely. Johnson & Johnson is not alone in requiring that kind of expertise and that scalability and support. Because most of these systems are deployed in warehouse or manufacturing facilities, there isn't a lot of skilled labor around, particularly familiar with a complex environment around radio frequency. Odin Technologies Easy Monitor Suite automates the RFID infrastructure. It allows us to do 24 by 7 monitoring, remote diagnostics, and push down changes to configuration and firmware, all from a secure data center in Northern Virginia. This gives Depew the worldwide scalability that they're looking for. The Easy Monitor tool supports multiple technologies and it enables senior executives to get a complete worldview of their RFID investment hard at work. It can also be leveraged by local facilities employees to see exactly where the devices are on-premise should any remediation or maintenance be required.